When it comes to Twitch streaming, I bet you didn't know there's actually two ways to host a Twitch channel. In this video right here, I'm gonna go over both of those modes. Plus, I'm gonna show you why hosting matters and how it can help you and one of your fellow streamers grow. Here we go. What is going on, all you awesome streamers? Wowed here helping you become bigger and better with everything Streamlabs. Now, if you're not familiar with what hosting is, it's easiest to think of it as sharing someone's Instagram post or video on your story or embedding someone's website link on your website. You're essentially embedding their stream on your channel to broadcast their content to your audience. In turn, helping them grow. Now, like I said in the beginning of the video, there's actually two ways to host someone on Twitch. The first way is more of a manual way. All you need to do is go to your own Twitch channel and in your chat, type in forward slash host, then put a space and type in the channel or user's name of the channel that you would like to host. And that's pretty much it. If you wanna unhost them or stop hosting them, you type in your own chat again, forward slash unhost, and that's it. This is a pretty straightforward way and easy because it gives you control of exactly who you wanna host and when. But you know what? The second way is actually pretty interesting because you can set up auto hosting. Auto hosting is great for just saving time. It also is an excellent feature and tool if you like to get your friends together to share each other's content. It will increase watch time and help cultivate a community. There's also free and paid services like Twitch Auto Host Team, which will help you develop as an individual or team. Their services help you get auto hosting by hundreds of streamers and thousands of followers simultaneously, among other things. To use auto host, you first need to click on your avatar image in the top right corner of your Twitch profile. Select settings from the left side navigation. From the drop down menu, select channels. Now you can click on featured content and switch the button over where it says automatically host list when you're offline. Now, of course, to auto host, you will need to create a list of channels you would like to auto host. So let me show you how to set that up. On the same page, we can click on the auto host list to manage our hosted channels. All we need to do is type in the names we'd like to search for and add them. Perhaps you have an awesome streamer in mind. For example, you could type in something like Wild for Games, but feel free to add and search for whatever names you would like. Once you find the name that you wanna add, click on add and now they're added to your list. Now that you have your list of streamers you would like to host, just switch on auto hosting and sit back and relax. Whenever someone is live, your host list will automatically be featuring them on your page. Now, a lot of streamers are worried about hosting other channels because they think they're taking their community and sharing it with somebody else. Thus, they're kind of losing their audience. And that's not true. Hosting actually adds a lot of benefits. It helps support and help others grow their audience. Plus growing your community by drawing in traffic to your page, and you're gonna build relationships with other content creators. And you know what? You're actually gonna show your fans and audience what you're interested in. It gives your audience something to cure your boredom and excitement about when you're not available on your own stream. Hosting and auto hosting is just one of the many tools that Twitch gives you to help you be a better streamer and content creator. And if you need any more help with anything on Twitch's platform or any streaming platform out there, that's where I come in to help you out. Gonna do you a favor and toss a couple of videos here up on screen to make you a bigger and better streamer. Wild for Games wishing you the best of luck, and as always, take care, and of course, peace.